What's up guys, Deranged Asylum, back bringing you another achievement guide. Once more we're in the Evil Within, the achievement we're going for is Silent Kill. This is for taking out five enemies in a row with a sneak kill or stealth kill without being detected. So after you talk about the stealth kill, that one does not count for the achievement. You'll be coming across the back of a guy and it'll teach you how to stealth kill, that will not count. Once you get that cutscene that you just saw, you're going to want to crouch behind this hay, wait for this guy to come out. After a while he'll start to walk away from you. So you can come out of cover and slowly start to walk behind him, holding down the RB. And once you're within range, you'll be prompted to press A. And that's your first stealth kill. So you want to turn around because there's a second guy behind. And you want to stick yourself up against this wall here on the corner. So you don't want to release the RB, you want to keep it held down. And we're going to have to wait a few seconds because this guy is going to come back. He's going to turn to his left before returning to the spot he's in now, which is where we'll kill him. It should be noted that before these two guys, you can, if you, if you fail to kill these two guys with a stealth kill, you can reload the checkpoint. And after these two guys, you'll trigger another checkpoint. And you can use these to reload if you need to. So you see now he's turned around and once he starts to walk away we can come out of cover and slowly start to make our way towards him and again when prompted to press A get the stealth kill and that's number two so now we need to go out onto the road and follow the road around to the right and there are going to be another two enemies up here. One's on the road up ahead. You want to avoid him first. And go for the guy at the back holding the torch. So we're going to go along the road. And we're going to go in towards the grass. And around the right of this wall. Now this enemy we're going to be taking out. He can spot you. He has got a torch. So you have to be very careful. And if you take the line that I take. To get to him he shouldn't spot you. You want to go around the back of this hay and the guy on the road can't see you as long as you stay in crouch. And you'll see like a overgrowth here you can sit in and if you timed it just right it doesn't matter if you haven't but he'll be on the left hand side ready to turn. The moment he turns you have to leave because he's, his patterns he's only walking for a couple of seconds turning and walking back. So you want to creep up behind him press the A button and that's your third stealth kill. Now we're going to go to the guy on the road. Now this one's easy as long as you stay crouched. He's constantly turning his back to you, so you can just walk down the road here, up behind him. And this is the easiest of the stealth kills. And that's number four. And now we want to make our way back up the road, and directly ahead is the last guy we're going to take out. There are actually six guys in this area, so there's another guy to his left. So make your way into this building. You're going to come across a trap. You might not be able to see it too clearly here, but if you slowly walk up, you'll get prompted to disarm the trap. You don't have to do that. You can swing straight around the left here, and, and there's the final guy. And once he starts to walk away, we're going to make our way forward and we're going to stealth kill him and that's number five you can wait where I was before I came out you can wait there until you're sure he's walking away and that's it 20 gamers course silent kill thanks for watching